so here we are at the brand U.S. stand at AIME, uh, the Los Angeles Tourism and Convention Board LA Tourism is the official marketing and sales organization for Los Angeles, uh, one of the world's best known destinations, uh, welcoming more than 40 million visitors annually. So here we have Mr. Craig Gibbons, is, uh, who is uh, the Sydney-based director for Los Angeles Tourism and Convention Board, and uh, we are actually talking about uh, the plans and tourism plans and business travel plans for brand USA and how Craig is going about it. So, hi Craig. Hi. Yeah. Uh, 2013 turned out uh, more than enterprising for 2000, more than enterprising than 2012, right? Yes. Um, it was actually recorded 42.2 million tourists to LA. Yes. Uh, reflect your thoughts on the contribution of the Asia Pacific region in augmenting this tourism figures? Uh, definitely, the Asia Pacific region is hugely important to LA, uh, particularly obviously the Asian markets centered around China um, and Australia and Japan. Um, LAX now is home to more uh, Chinese carriers than any other U port, airport in the US. And to really bring us forward as the gateway to North America, we've just spent over one and a half billion dollars renovating Tom Bradley International, which uh, all finished uh, renovations just last month, to a brand new terminal facility, which is a world-class facility for Los Angeles. Great. Um, can you just tell us, like, uh, if your uh, primary source market is uh, from the Middle East, or is it from um, the Europe? Is it? Um, yeah, is it from... sure. Our top three markets. Are... Yeah. Firstly, China. Right. Uh, second is Australia, right. and third is followed by the UK. Uh, they're okay. our top three international markets. Right. Great. Uh, what are the primary takeaways for MICE planners and event organizers as, as and when they plan a conference or event in Los Angeles? I think one of the things that people are looking for is unique off-the-shelf, uh, off outside-of-the-box um, ideas. And one of the big things we like to work at with LA Tourism is we're the home of the entertainment industry and we like to give people that touch of Hollywood, a little taste of celebrity to everything they do, from the hotel they choose to where they dine at to the experiential experiences that they offer their clients uh, and things that they see in the movies, on TV and they read about in the Hollywood gossip mags, a lot of these experiences they can uh, arrange with their client and that's something unique to LA and that's what we really try to offer through our programs. Fantastic. So uh, basically no job role is as interesting without challenges. So could you just uh, tell us some of the challenges that you are facing uh, or you are actually striving hard to overcome? Well, definitely. I think you know one of the challenges was the airport, and obviously uh, the government in LA and California realised that that we needed an upgraded facility to bring us up to world class standards. So it was over a two year project, um, and that's something that we really had to put into place as a game changer. Um, so also that we can target new carriers and increase the services of existing carriers flying in there. And the other challenge is just like everybody else these days, we're not up just against other destinations in America. We're up against global destinations. Uh, and that's something that we really strive to find what is unique about LA and what experiences can we offer that clients can't experience anywhere else and that's one thing we really do try to promote. Right, I was actually coming to this like it was a 1.7 billion dollar uh, new Tom Bradley International Terminal that actually came up. So um, that is actually the Lax Airport right now. Yes. Uh, so I would actually uh, think about uh, asking your views and opinions about how this uh, new investment would actually bring about more in more tourists to LA and more business travelers. Yeah, right? de yeah? Well, definitely. Well, it's 18 new gates, mm -hmm. all uh, taking you know new generation aircraft, you know, Dreamliners and A380s. Um, so basically allow us you know, to fit more aircraft in uh, and take more flights. But one of the other things is Westfield at LAX. So we partnered with Westfield. Um, nobody knows how to create a shopping mall better than Westfield. They're the world's leader. And we created something called Westfield at LAX. And it's a premium and dining and retail facility uh, with 60 new outlets, uh, many of them are in anywhere else in the world, uh, for passengers to experience upon departure. But one of the other things we really worked hard on was upgrading our immigration and custom facilities to make it a lot more open plan and logistically to get more people through per hour as every flight comes through. And that was by arranging a lot more desks and really working hard to make sure that logistically people get through a lot easier and a lot quicker than what they had in the past. Great. Uh, this is a new trend in the market, like not very new, but pretty new, like the digital transparency, the emerging uh, social media marketing, the emerging market of uh, 
technological advancements. So how is uh, Brand USA well, keeping up with the pace? Not so much that I can speak for LA Tourism. Right. Uh, LA Tourism has one of the largest Facebook followings of any National Tourism Bureau globally. Right. Uh, it's the, and we invest a lot of time in that. We have a, a very hard-working social media team in LA uh, across all social media channels, uh, really trying to keep that activity out there and LA at the front of the center of people's mind. Um, being an established destination, we you know don't really work on a lot of the traditional mediums. We just don't need to. Um, so we really do focus a lot more on the digital world in terms of getting content and that LA kind of flavor and vibe out there to consumers as well as the mice industry. Perfect. Uh, so just wrap it up. Uh, can you just uh, brief us, uh, brief our readers and listeners about uh, the three most uh, fantastic incentives or the three most uh, happening incentives of uh, uh, LA? Right? Well, the movie industry. We have amazing movie partners such as Universal Studios, uh, Warner Brothers, Paramount and Sony Pictures. So whatever crazy idea that you can come up with as an event organizer, uh, you can partner with our studio uh, members and they've probably already done it or they can recreate it for you. Um, so if it can't be done in Hollywood, it can't be done anywhere else. Great. It was nice talking to you, Mr. Craig Gibbons. Um, I hope uh, Brand USA and LA, LA Tourism does well in 2014 and beyond. Hope you have a nice day ahead. Thank you for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks.